Active stereo systems such as PrimeSense have shown great promise for real-time 3D acquisition. However, applications like capture of non-rigid objects for games require more detail and accuracy than such systems currently provide. Motivated by such applications, we designed a variant of space-time stereo, a high-accuracy offline method, to run in real-time on modern GPU hardware. We call this algorithm Espresso. Espresso factors space-time stereo into a descriptive pre-computation phase, followed by slanted plane cost aggregation over multiple hypotheses. This factorization is the key to the algorithm's speed. Espresso performs matching across five infrared frame pairs, four of which are illuminated by dot patterns, and the fifth with ambient floodlight. Each stack of four patterned images is pre-processed to compute descriptors for small 3x3x4 spatiotemporal windows. We use a binary descriptor, in which each bit is determined by a comparison between two pixel values in the window. Pre-computing these descriptors helps constrain computational costs, because temporal aggregations happen before depth testing. The left side descriptor images are then split into 32 by 28 pixel tiles, and a patch match style sampling algorithm iteratively proposes disparity planes for each tile. Each disparity plane hypothesis is tested by first resampling the pre-computed descriptors in the right camera descriptor image, then computing Hamming distances between the corresponding descriptors, and finally filtering the per pixel costs to handle low signal areas. We use the permeability filter, an inexpensive multi-pass recursive edge aware filter for cost filtering. The permeability filter combines several horizontal and vertical passes of weighted exponential smoothing where the weights control the local permeability. In Espresso, the unpatterned fifth image from the capture sequence is used as a guide image, smoothing costs across continuous surfaces but keeping them discontinuous across high gradients. By varying dot patterns over time, we can use descriptors with very small spatial windows. These small descriptors work well even on oblique surfaces. So we can aggregate costs over slanted disparity planes without recomputing them in each plane and the results stay accurate, even close to depth edges. This unique set of features enables Espresso to perform high accuracy stereo very efficiently. Here's a working prototype of our system. Infrared diffractive optical elements project time-varying dot patterns. The cameras and dot projectors are triggered by an Arduino microcontroller. Frames are captured at 180 Hz, with every third frame captured without patterns. Frames are processed in overlapping groups of five frames centered around these guide frames. The resulting depth frames are output at 60 Hz. The prototype system runs in less than 11 milliseconds per frame on a Titan XP GPU. Espresso's output is substantially more precise than state-of-the-art assisted stereo methods such as HashMatch, shown here. Note especially the quality of the depth on oblique surfaces and near depth edges where HashMatch simply discards pixels. Because Espresso uses arbitrary high-frequency illumination sources, multiple sensors can capture depth simultaneously without interference. Synchronized RGB cameras capture color texture without visible dot patterns. We think Espresso can unlock many interesting interactive applications in entertainment, communication, and collaboration.